guys and welcome to the vlog boom 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 <laughs> anyways so today is friday i went to i had a lot of things to do hey um and i couldn't vlog because it was awkward awks situations but uh, we're back now and I went to the bank after I went to the bank I realized as a person you cannot say you have one bank account oh sorry you need to have more than one because I'm telling you there's gonna be something that's gonna require the other one but anyways yeah bought a jean and a top that's the thing I never buy jeans at Mr. Price at normal prices they're always on sale <laughs> i have good luck but yeah pray that good luck continues anyway so tomorrow i'm probably gonna go see charlie my dad and yeah and then sunday i know what i'm gonna do on sunday but i'll figure something out i have a lot of Works by Bootsy stuff to do. I feel like I say this in every vlog, but literally I always do. Because weekdays is like work. Weekends is like that. So I do always have something to do. Anyways, I'll catch up with you guys later. And yeah, home now. I haven't showered. I haven't. Okay, no, that's all. <laughs> I was just doing a few things. But I'm actually now only having breakfast. And it's actually like 12, bruv. Hello. Mm, okay. I'm not going to I'm not going to So I'm gonna make pasta. Yes. I'm gonna make pasta and I'm gonna make it with some pesto chicken. Sorry about this. With some pesto chicken. So yeah, I'm gonna okay, let me show you. see them clouds and it's winter so it's a bit depressing but it's fine I'll be fine hi guys so um, I'm just on my way to see Charlie and yeah Bought him a few toys and gonna clean up his little space. Yeah. Charlie, Charlie. Charlie, Charlie. Charlie. Charlie, come on. Come on, Charlie. Charlie. Charlie, Charlie. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. Perfect, Louis, you don't need Charlie. Charlie, show them you have no teeth. 
Your teeth are oh, not there. <laughs> Charlie the big boom. Charlie. Hey. It was a fun time with Chani. I'm not going to leave my dad's. And I'm heading back to my mom's, my home. This is still my home, you know? Yeah. Um, I'm basically home, still walking though. But I wanted to share something. So, while I was with Charlie today, he barked. Now, going on anyways so he barked and I think it was my first time hearing his bark because he's a puppy right he's only like two months old oh now in like a few weeks but it's like that bark that came out of that dog was quite mature like Good boy. What was the fourth? What did you have on it, Jamie? Let's play. Do you make some vlog? Yeah, I can help. Let's play. If any lady in Jayan, Jayan, it's a group of dogs. In Jayan, I can't go. I'm not going to go. I'm going to go. I'm going to go. Hello guys and welcome to the vlog. Boom, 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 boom. <laughs> I think this is my new intro. It's growing on me. But you know. Um so today I my dog is sick and I went to my dad's to see it. Like Tata and my Tata and Buffer King were coming with me to my dad's house to go see the sick dog and I was pretty sick you guys um, have seen how energetic Charlie is but today it was like he wasn't like as energetic and he wasn't you know and I saw that he had sorry about this TMI he had thrown up twice and yeah I just think he ate something that he wasn't supposed to and I'm not gonna worry because I don't know if you guys know um, we've had a puppy before at my dad's house and it was at the beginning of the year we had a puppy and um, so where I bought Charlie there was like I said a puppies before Charlie and my one of my co-workers um bought two puppies from there and these two puppies got sick and obviously i know that you're supposed to isolate puppies when they are like young and all that so they were isolated but they were sick so i assumed there was some sickness from where they came from so um the one died and then after the one died by co-workers got two puppies and then we already had a puppy and it was bought from a separate place it wasn't bought from the same place I hate it when the people when I'm vlogging I'll tell you the story when it's on the inside okay so I'm home and I wanted to just finish what I was saying so 
my coworker bought puppies from a place that was the same and we had a puppy from a different place and then they were sick whatever and then one died and then after one died they realized that they were sick they realized after the one died so um and the one died pretty quickly after they realized that they were sick i don't know so after that they then took um the dog to the vet but our puppy needed to get vaccinated it was it's time to get vaccinated so it was like okay you can take both puppies there we didn't think that the sick the the, the thing was contagious and it was very i don't know we didn't think fast quick on our feet whatever so basically what happened was by the time the dogs got back from the vet our dog had been infected and then it also died good morning guys so it's currently where's my watch it's somewhat nine in the morning it's let me check it's 10 past nine in the morning and um so my room is really messy uh i don't know if i told you guys but i'm alone for the weekend and i found the house in a mess well parts of the house in just shambles so i'm gonna do some of that yeah but after i do that i'm also gonna take a shower i have a little bit of work like work work to do today so i'm going to cover that i have i have a field day um we sometimes help customers that cannot be helped during the week on the weekends because you know some not everyone has time on during the week so i'm so sorry that i'm ugly today but i just wanted to come and tell you that so what i'm gonna do he's literally all the way that side of town I need to call my dad and see what's going on exactly. This uh, half to do list, today's half to do list. I'm going to talk about the half to do list because the full to do list will get will happen when I'm back. So, number one, wash myself. Number two, clean up that freaking kitchen and this bedroom. Number three, go on to the field. Well, talk to my dad while I'm cleaning so that by the time I'm done, he's like on his way, you know, or he's not on his way or he has a plan for me. And then, oh, I ordered sushi for 3 p.m. today. And I'm so excited because I haven't had sushi in almost 362 days. What day is it today? It's the 9th. 363 days. I haven't had sushi in 363 days. Do you know how difficult that is on the soul? This is my breakfast. One moment. I was actually going to talk about something in the previous. Oh, shit. I need to upload my vlog. Okay. I just remembered that I have to edit my vlog. But before I edit out the other vlog i had to talk about something but i wasn't in the environment too uh it is currently a few minutes to to one no hey no it's 12 55 did i do anything no i didn't <laughs> just fine. i didn't do anything i was literally watching the late late show videos with Nicki Minaj in them and I was just reminding myself how much of an icon she is so yeah that's it but anyways I was going to edit the video and I'm still in the process of editing it I was just casually watching Nicki Minaj and then editing and then watching so it wasn't very productive but anyways it's about time I get dressed to go to the client with my dad he's on his way from his house and it's about like a 15 minute drive so I'm like I think I need to also walk into town so we meet in town yeah it is so let me get dressed and yeah my sushi still isn't arriving just yet and I'm a bit anxious but we'll see so I'm going to show you my outfit. I'm not really sure about it, but it's like, whatever. What else? It's my jersey. Very popular jersey that I'm always wearing. 
<laughs> so it's this knitted jersey with my sneakers. Like I feel like I look basic, you know? Uh, I'm not bringing anything special. My sushi is on the way. <laughs> okay. These pants, you see, they're a bit big, but I like the loose fit. It's always so weird because if I got a smaller size around the waist, my thighs weren't gonna fit. So now it's like my thighs fit so nicely, but the waist, yeah? So big, but it's okay. Look at this. Look at this. <laughs> no flashing. My sushi's here. I want to take an Instagram picture before, but I also want to like look at it. So you got the soy, got the chopsticks. Yeah. Ah, I'm so excited. I love sushi. Yeah, you see the tiny wasabi? It looks like dog poo, but it's, it's fine. No. Dip it in some soy. I just got back. Cutie, cute girl, go by. <laughs> but I got myself some snacks because, yeah, um, your girl likes snacking. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna eat that sushi right now. I hope there's no one in the house. That's so sad. No, and it's empty. Oh, <laughs> you guys don't believe what I did. I bought electricity before I left to put it in, and I didn't put it in. So it's like. You know, girl, where was your mind at? So let me put in the electricity, devour my sushi, then I'll show you my snacks. I don't know if you guys... Wait, let me wipe the camera. I don't know if you guys have watched Pride and Prejudice, right? The one with Kira Knightley, the 2005 one. I think it's 2005. Yes. If you've watched that Pride and Prejudice... I think it's also in the book, that part. You know, after Lizzie gets asked, um, like after Mr. 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 Darcy comes to ask Lizzie's hand for Lizzie's hand in marriage to Mr. Bennett, it's like everyone's super happy. And then Mr. I mean, Lizzie tells Mr. Bennett what Mr. Darcy did for um, Kitty and Mr. The other Mr. The other nigger. Remember what? Yeah, you know, Mr. Bennett was so happy afterwards and he was like, if anyone wants to marry Kitty or Mary, come in. Mary, Mary. If anyone wants to marry Mary or Kitty, come in. Like, I'm a joy. Like, I'm a peace. Like, everything is just here. You know? That's how I'm feeling right now. Because that sushi, it just cleaned this heart of mine. Jola's not going right. It's fine. I got sushi. <laughs> if I'm honest, wait. If I'm honest with myself right now, <laughs> eh, that sushi girl is lucky she has closing times and whatever because I was about to get more sushi right now. That's how, you know, you know when you when you deprive yourself of something and then you end up binging. That's literally how I feel right now. But because we have no... Sushi. <laughs> I'm really lazy. So, let me tell you guys something. Wait, let me grab the tripod. Because this needs me to be talking. So, <clears throat> this is not straight. There we go. So, this is the deal. <laughs> because we, like, I don't understand. Can I tell you guys I lost 6 kgs? A girl is losing weight. Instead of <laughs> but anyways, um, I was gonna say, how about we get some pizza? Because it's like, there's no food. They left me with no food. They left me with breakfast food. That's the one thing right there. Now I ain't got no food. 
Number two, if I want food, I have to go down, down. I have to walk down the shop line to get food because shop line is the closest. So now I must walk down, down there by the shop line to get myself food. Or I could just easily call up Domino's and get them to deliver me some pizza. <laughs> I mean, what's what sounds more appealing? Guess what's here? <laughs> That's the more fucking Domino's pizza. <laughs> Zach, oh my gosh, this is so large. I don't like meaty pizza, so I bought three cheeses pizza. <laughs> oh, so good, but it's so oily. But after eating that artisan pizza, guys, this is going to be dinner, breakfast, lunch, dinner again. <laughs> um, After eating artisan pizza, like, this kind of pizza just isn't, like, top tier. But it's, like, it's only so it delivers, so. Mm. Mm. I was really in the mood to pig out. But who gets full on two slices of pizza? Like, did I just get full on two slices of pizza? <laughs> Good morning. I haven't even showered. And I'm still, you know, young, young kind of. And so I'm not saying a drink album, and I'm like, you Canadian masterminds. I've actually never enjoyed any Drake album. I always enjoy like certain songs in the album, but I never enjoyed the full album. And this is the first time that I'm like Drake. Okay. So I have paired the uh, this looks like a mess. My room has to be a mess because of how busy I am. But I've paired all the stuff that I need to be that need to be paired, and I'm about to get ready so I can head over to the photo shoot place, shoot, and then come back, edit, post. <laughs> it's a lot. So, yeah. Just giving an update. I'll show you the pairings just now. Yeah. Okay. I hope you guys can see it. Why does my head look so big? It's because of this wig right there. Okay. So anyways, we're here at the location. And it's, it's pretty it's a pretty busy road. I don't know how I'll be able to change freely, but this is the spot that I want. See very clearly. I'm going to get ready for the first shoot. So I don't know if you guys can see, but the palm trees, the vibe, the grass, the house. This is the president's house, the prime minister's house, but he actually doesn't live here, so like it's perfect. And look, hey, that's him. Oh shit, the prime minister's here. Oh my gosh, so I did my first outfit change, literally right here. And the soldiers came up to me and were like, yo, bruv, what are you doing here? And I was just like, oh my god. They're like, you're not allowed to be here. But then they're like, what are you doing? And then I explained to them, oh, I'm trying to sell this, this, and this. And I have, uh, um, yeah. So they were just like, you know, and then I told them what I'm doing. And they're like, okay, be, like, you know, it's okay if you're here. But, like, don't take too many pictures of the actual, like, house itself. So, you know, because it's, like, security Bobs. And there's soldiers, and I'm so scared of soldiers. I need to wrap it up and change because, yeah, I still have two more pants to go and one, one top. So I need to find like a quiet corner to go change, and then I'll be back. 